All right, welcome back, e-bikers. So it's a beautiful day up here in the Northwest today, and I am down by the river, been out for a ride on this brand new High Boy P6 e-bike. Kind of a coincidence, High Boy used to be my nickname back in college, but it didn't have nothing to do with riding e-bikes. But I have really been super impressed with this e-bike, especially for the price point. This usually runs about $1,500, you can actually get it for $430 off right now. I'm gonna have a link underneath of this video in the description and down in the pinned comments where you guys can get the deals. You can actually get this front suspension, 750 watt Bafang rear hub motor e-bike for just $1,049 right now. And this is actually a pretty impressive e-bike, man. Like I said, for the price point, I haven't quite seen anything like it. You do have the big knobby, fat four inch tires. You also have hydraulic front suspension on this. It's got a big beefy frame and an internal battery that clicks in and out of the frame itself. So you can have a second battery. They're easily interchangeable. So I'm gonna go ahead and bring you guys up a little bit closer so you can check out all the specs on this e-bike and get a little better view of it. Got a nice little LCD screen here. That is gonna show you the um, power mode you are in, one through five, you also have zero, and then you're doing all the work. You also have your speedometer, your odometer, and your battery charge, which you can see, I've gotten this thing to about half charge. The quick acceleration. Zero to 28 miles an hour, like nothing flat. So as I was saying, you do have a 750 watt, a Fang rear hub motor, and this thing really gets going, man. Super fast acceleration on this. You also have a nine speed Shimano gear shift and derailleur, front and rear disc brakes, big beefy 26 by four inch tires with a lot of tread on this. As you guys will see in the video, when we go out riding on it, we did take this off road. This thing handles really well, tons of traction. I would definitely feel confident riding this in rain, sleet, snow any kind of weather conditions, as well as gravel, dirt trails, grass, anything like that. A really nice front headlight with four LEDs. That thing will definitely light up your ride at nighttime. You've also got a pretty powerful horn on this thing. I do like that better than the bell because when you're riding out in traffic, I don't feel like anybody in a car is gonna hear that little bell, but they're definitely gonna hear that. Now this little bag is just an accessory I added to carry my equipment down today. But of course you can hook all of that kind of stuff on there if you wanna get some accessories for it. The brakes are really nice, work well. I didn't have any problems stopping even from top speeds. And then like I said, you do have this very nice nine speed Shimano gear shift and derailleur on here. I was really impressed with how well this thing handled. The acceleration is phenomenal, man. This bike really just wants to go whether you're using the throttle or the pedal assist on it. It is rated as a class three e-bike, so it will do up to 28 miles per hour. And you guys are gonna get a good chance to see this high boy out in action doing its thing, because my buddy Chris and I took this up about halfway between the town I'm in, Wenatchee, and the next town monitor. There is a bridge called Sleepy Hollow, and it runs into the orchards and some hills out there. So we were able to take this thing up some pretty steep hills, actually rode it right through the orchards. So why don't we go ahead and check out that riding footage. Then we'll come back and I'll give you guys my opinions on this high boy P6. Check it out.
So what's your first impressions of this high boy? It accelerates, it just boom, it just wants to go on its own. A lot of fun. Um, How's it handle? The tires are really awesome, of course. I mean, what are they, four inches or so? Yep. A um, lot of fun. It's a bike you can trust. Really economical. You're getting a lot for your money. And I just like how it accelerates. How to do on the hills? It did awesome on the hills, um, especially on the downhill, going through the orchard, going through gravel. I felt safe. It's just the acceleration I was really impressed with. So, all right, guys, we had so much fun out test riding this thing, man. I'm telling you, one of my favorite new e-bikes I've looked at. I am really kind of just shocked at how low of a price point this thing has, even at the original price. But right now, for $1,049, man, I do not think you could beat what you're getting with this e-bike for the price that it is selling at. So if you're interested in checking out the High Boy P6 for yourself, go ahead and use that link. I think it's going to be up here. Anyways, there will be a link there, but you can also use the link down in the description or the pinned comment. Save that $430 on just a fantastic e-bike. Now, it is a bigger full-size mountain bike, so I would say if you are a tiny person, it may not be the bike for you, but anybody else, you know, I would say five foot seven, five foot eight and above. This is going to be a great ride. My buddy Chris is about five foot ten. He actually had the seat hiked up even further than it is now. But just a really fun, quick, accelerating e bike. Good top speed, 28 miles per hour, the five level pedal assist. And even just in full electric with that throttle, man, I'm telling you, this thing really takes off. So all right, guys, if you haven't done so already, please do subscribe to this channel, ring the bell so you get all the notifications. When the videos go up, we have a bunch of great new e-bikes we're gonna be looking at in the next couple of weeks. Don't wanna miss none of that. If you enjoyed yourself at any time during this video or if you like the look or the price point on this High Boy P6, be sure to give us a thumbs up. They're greatly appreciated. And leave me a comment down below. I'd love to hear your guys' comments. Have you tried an e-bike like this? Have you tried the High Boy? Or even just what kind of e-bike you ride? But all right, guys, it is a beautiful day. I'm going to go out and do a little bit more riding. I think I'm going to do the loop trail. Um, we're just about finished at work down at the e-bike store, so I've got a chance to go out and do a little bit of an evening ride. Thank you for hanging out with me for a little bit today, checking out this video, and I will catch you right back here with a brand new e-bike to take a look at on Green Motion. Have a great rest of your e-biking day, guys.